Well, I made this video because a lot of people are saying silly things like the bones that we're working with are rock. They're solid rock and they're not bone. Well, technically these are fossils, but they're not rock. They behave like bone. In fact, hospitals all over the world use a test to dissolve them in EDTA, a weak acid. And so I decided to make this video to show that these are bones. They're not rock. They do dissolve in EDTA, which is a very weak acid. In fact, it is only about as strong as vinegar. So let's watch, and I want you to see how these bones dissolve. Now, in the beginning, I'm going to play it at regular speed. And so you're going to see these dissolve pretty quickly. This is a nanotyrannus vertebra in EDTA. It's a shard, a piece of the vertebra. You can see my fingers come in to the picture every now and then. I'm going to play it over and over again. Uh, you can also see me fill up the solution. You see my fingers. And I'm going to slow it down at the end. But just look at the bone. Watch the bone as the EDTA dissolves it away. And so this behaves like actual bone, not like rock. We do not need hydrochloric acid or anything like that to dissolve it. Now this is regular speed. Actually, I've slowed this down, so it's slower than regular speed. You can see me fill it up with a pipette, and actually the EDTA should be changed out several times a day, uh, or even five or six times a week. But here come my fingers, and I'm waving it in the EDTA to show you that this is a very weak acid. So folks, these are bones and not rocks. So don't let people make up stories about this. This is not hard rock that has protected the soft tissue inside. These are bones, folks. These are bones that were buried not so long ago, and that's why they still dissolve in a vinegar-like acid, and that's why the soft tissues are still present in them. They're not millions and millions of years old. So you folks that think you know the science, get your science straight. And you folks that are impressed about this, talk it up, because this is huge. This is so important to spread to everyone we know. Thank you.